Oh, that's horrible. <laughs> Thank you. Cheap day there. Uh, it's the 10th of February, about uh, 10 o'clock in the morning. Uh, head for Birmingham Airport around midday uh, for the start of the Thailand trip. So, this is video number one on uh, my trip to Thailand. Here we go, we're just about to leave sunny bedrock. Heading for Birmingham Airport. <laughs> so you're going to miss me? <laughs> so Roger's told me he's going to miss me loads. <laughs> That's a picture of my old house. It's a wonderful day. <laughs> day <with Bailey. laughs> so you ain't actually going to post them, so who's going to be interested in it? Can you want to redo that site to boring day? <laughs> it's not a toy day, boring day. Here's me driving on the motorway. <laughs> Just at the train station now. Just about to get the Megalith into the airport. About a minute in that to the airport. So I've just found the area where I've got to check in. It's not uh, ready yet, it's nearly one o'clock now. So uh, I think they'll be uh, opening up in the next half hour. The time is 3.15. Uh, they've just opened the gate, so I'm going to make my way down there in a second. Got through all of the security and all that, uh, that rigmarole out of the way, thank goodness. So now it's just a matter of two planes and uh, getting to Bangkok.
Istanbul airport, took just over four hours. Absolutely massive. Okay, so we're just approaching Bangkok now. Another five minutes we should have landed. So we are a couple of minutes out from Bangkok. There's the, land there's the landing gear just gone down. So uh, it's only going to be a couple of minutes now. Welcome to Thailand. Thank you very much. Bye bye. Suddenly the temperature's gone way up in this air bridge. Okay, so that's through uh, all the COVID stuff, I think. So now I've got to go and find my suitcase somewhere or other. Hopefully be down here. Just go through the customs. You see how that goes. Shit, so we're at the airport, all through the customs. Got my way to the hotel. A bit of a rigmarole, a bit of a pain in the ass, but uh, it all worked out in the end, so. Uh, okay, so it's 4.13, the port is to the test centre for the Covid. Just got my sample. Just go around the back now to uh, get the testing. Bit of a queue here. Yeah. Horrible. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, well, that was horrible. Yeah, yes. Yeah. Uh, so you are on the way. Didn't take yeah, very long. I just make a test now. I just make and 
it's possible for a more quick result, for more layout result, you know, if I pay extra. Uh, yeah, you can have the hospitals? Yeah, I just take now, I just take cash now from Lady, but she tell me if I want more quick. So that's my first uh, COVID test done. Uh, Poke my eye out going on my nostril, but uh, so pretty unpleasant. But uh, the job's done, so uh, that's good. Just have to wait for the results. Not sure whether I get up later today or tomorrow until I get them. I'm stuck in the hotel. 4.50. Just by ASCII, ASUP, VTS station. I think my second hotel is just over the road from here somewhere. But we're going to go, well, we're going to turn around and, and go a, a left, I would have thought, just down here. Down to our hotel. It's crazy busy. my second place where I'm staying. Now we're looking at the distance, so I've got to walk up the road to get there. Should just be just down here on the left. Stand in a little cattle tray. So once, once they've showed us to the room, I have to just wait for the results. Okay, so it looks quite nice. There you go, so I'm right down the end of the corridor into 502. Let's have a look. And this is my room. Add in there, get a bit of light. So we'll go round the room in a second. This is the hotel room. A little wardrobe area here, a pair of slippers and whatever. And come in. You've got a TV mounted into the wall. Some drinks. Coffee making as well. You got the phone in the corner. They're going to get in touch with me. Let me know when the test is passed. Then uh, a nice sofa sit and watch the telly at. Big bed. Into the bathroom. Quite a modern place really, you've got a nice sink, sitter, and a fairly large shower. So all in all, it looks a fairly nice hotel anyway, to be quarantined in until the, the 
test comes through. Okay, so there's some, I think it's roast pork, but we'll have a little look at that in a minute. Some samosas, chips, and some fresh fruit, and a can of Coke. So we'll see how that uh, tastes, I'll let you know. Well, it doesn't taste too bad. Uh, it turned out to be roast chicken, with vegetables, chips, and some samosas. So keeping me alive anyway so it's good yeah not, not bad at all happy with this